Hi, I'm LG and Olus. Welcome to Better Vital for Saturday, March the 11th. We're looking at the weekly statistics for the beginning Wednesday, March the 8th, and we're looking for a track where we have high probability of coming out ahead by looking at our percent in the money percent win rate of percent place. Here we go with the aqueduct 27 races, 81% of the money, 37% win rate, 30% place. Charlestown, 32 races. 69% in the money, 28% win rate and 13% place. Delta Downs, 39 races, 64% in the money, 31% win rate and 15% place. We have a feature where we can simply click on a column header to do a sort on that particular column. Here we go, percent in the money. Laurel Park with 26 races. We are 92% in the money with a 42% win rate and a 15% place. Aqueduct with 27 races. We are 81% in the money and 37% win rates. We can do the same thing with the win column. Click on the header. And here we go. Laurel Park. We have 42% win rate. Louisiana down 38% win rate. Aqueduct 37% win rate. All sound readers 35% win rate. This week, let's uh, see if we can find a race at Laurel Park. And we're going to go to our rankings. And Laurel Park. March the 11th. And we're looking for a race where we have a high probability of coming out ahead by looking at our ranking numbers. And we're looking for a big gap between the top three and the rest of the field. Here we go, 28, 21, 75, 20.5 and 10.5. There's a nice big gap between the one horse and the two horse. Let's take a quick look. This is a reading claimer for three-year-olds with a purse of 22,000. Now, generally speaking, I like to stay away from maiden races because they're very unpredictable. So let's continue with race number two. 18.5, 15.75, 12, no big gap here. So we're going to skip race number two, go on to race number three. 25, 75, 22, 75, 12.5, 11, 75. There's a nice big gap here. Um, but this is again a maiden race as can be seen from these little asterisks. These asterisks identify first time starters, and so this is a maiden race, and we like to stay away from this maiden race. Uh, for those people that really want to gamble, the six horse is a nice big uh, gap between the six horse and the rest of the field. So there's a high probability for that horse to come in. Let's go on to race number four. 19, 15, 5, 13, 25, 12, 25. No big gap here. So we're going to skip race number four, go on to race number five. 21.5, 16.5, 13, 25, 11.5. There's a nice big gap between a six horse and a four horse. Uh, 10 point difference. Let's take a look. It's another claimer for four years old and up. Uh, five and a half furlong, a nice sprint race. Um, let's uh, continue and keep race number five in mind. Go on to race number six. 20.25, 20 18, 1475, 13. Again, this is a maiden race, as can be seen from this little asterisk. So we're going to skip race number 6 and go on to race number 7. 15, 25, 14, 13, 12. No big gap here. So we're going to skip race number 7. Go on to race number 8. Race number 8, 27.5, 17.5, 15.25, 14.5. There's a nice big gap between the seven horse and the one horse. Let's take a quick look. Race number 8. Race number 8 is uh, a starter allowance for four years old and up. And we have Ruby's Love, Ren. December the 6th, we're an 86 buyer rating at the 6 for a long distance. So let's keep race number 8 in mind. And go on to race number 9. Race number 9, 26.5, 17.75, 14, 5, 13, 5. There's a nice big gap between the 4 horse and the 1 horse. Let's take a quick look on race number 9. Race number 9 is a maiden race, and again, we like to stay away from maiden races. So, this week, um, by the way, this this may actually be a very good uh, race to gamble on, because 
This horse, the number four horse, is uh, trained by Linda Rice, who is very good uh, with horses. So with a big gap like this, there's a very high likelihood for this horse to come in. But this week, uh, let's go to race number eight. We have a nice big gap of 13 points between the seven horse and the one horse. And for those people that have a premium membership, I'll be doing an in-depth analysis of race number eight. So I hope to see you on the inside at horseraceadvantage.com, Laurel Park, race eight.